Hello, I'm JT Quicks. I love you all. You're all awesome. This week, we're going to talk about the corruption known as prejudice. Okay? Makes you give up. That's what it does. Okay? That's going to be the name of the video. The corruption known as prejudice makes you give up. Explained from heaven. That's going to be the name of the video. Okay? Alright. Uh, Twelve years ago, I accidentally delivered my soul to heaven. Okay? Alright. Uh, I see the truth in real time. I see evil. I see prejudice and hate. I see evil. Okay? I see uh, Satan. Say if you can't hide from me anymore. Satan is fear. Fear is Satan. Okay? And when you accept that as the truth, we can start fighting evil again. Okay? Uh, what else? Um, yeah. I'm in the war for heaven. Okay? I am in the war for heaven. My life is a war against evil. Okay? All right? I entered the war for heaven a long time ago. Okay? Back before I delivered my soul to heaven. I was being attacked by prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Then I accidentally delivered my soul to heaven. Okay? All right? Um, the reason evil is there is to keep your souls out of heaven. That's the reason why evil is there. Okay? Right? And uh, I fight evil for Jesus Christ. Okay? So, I fight evil for Jesus Christ. I'm in the war for heaven. Okay? And the reason evil is there is to keep your souls out of heaven. That's the reason why it's there. And I know why that is. I learned that truth. Okay? Why your souls are not in heaven. Okay? I learned the truth why your souls are not in heaven. All right? What's keeping your souls out of heaven is the prejudice and hate. Okay? That's evil. Okay? That is what's keeping your souls out of heaven. This keeps your love weak in fear. Okay? What prejudice does is prejudice makes you give up. Okay? That's why it's there. The corruption known as prejudice makes you give up. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you never deliver your soul to heaven and you never see the truth from heaven. Okay? Alright? Um, did you know when you remove all your fear, your soul enters heaven? That's because Satan is fear. Fear is Satan. Okay? Alright? Uh, what happened to me is this is what happens when you increase the forces of your love. When you increase the forces of your love, because this is what happened to me, okay? The forces of my love react against fear, okay? And when the forces of my love react against fear, I get attacked by prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, okay? okay? I drive the demons, trolls, and cowards. I drive the prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards. I drive them mad, and then I'm hated. This is why I'm probably the most hated person on the planet, okay? Because these people live in fear. When they live in fear, they defend Satan, okay? Live in fear, defend Satan. Remove your fear, defend heaven, okay? All right, uh, yeah, okay? Uh, what else? The laws of prejudice are there to make you give up. Okay? That's why the laws of prejudice are there. Things like, I can't, I cannot, you can't, you cannot, that's impossible. Those are the laws of prejudice. Okay? Those are uh, discouragements. These things are called discouragements. Okay? You find that in prejudice hate okay discouragements okay and what that does is 
that discourages you to make you give up. That's what it does. Okay? That's why prejudice is there. Prejudice is there to make you give up. Okay? That's why I tell you never ever give up to win against evil. Okay? A good warrior never ever gives up to win against evil. Okay? They kick the crap out of evil and they deliver their soul to heaven. Okay? All right? Um, what else? Yeah. Okay? So, what happens is the prejudice is there. It's the corruption. And this is the same corruption that Jesus was going after when he was alive. Okay? All right? This is the same corruption that Jesus was going after. Jesus Christ was going after this corruption when he was alive. Okay? What happened to Jesus Christ was he was attacked by evil before he could show you how to deliver your souls to heaven. That is the truth I learned from heaven. Okay? And another truth I learned from heaven was that Jesus Christ is unbreakable love. Jesus Christ is powerful, unbreakable love. I learned that from heaven too. Okay? And that's what I show you how to do in my videos is become powerful, unbreakable love, just like Jesus Christ, okay, all right, we're going to bust the laws of prejudice, okay, that's what I show you how to do, I want you to break evil, I don't want evil breaking you, I want you to break evil, and that's what I show you how to do in my videos, okay, all right, um, yeah, okay, uh, this is a war for heaven. This is not a religion. Okay? So it's a little hard to put a positive spin on this when it's a war for heaven. Okay? All I can do is stay as positive as I can. Okay? When I explain this to you. Okay? Alright? Because you're in the war for heaven. Okay? You're going to become a warrior for heaven. Okay? When you win, heaven wins. Okay? Right? Uh, and you'll also be fighting evil for Jesus Christ. Okay? You'll be fighting evil for Jesus Christ, love in heaven. Okay? And Jesus Christ, love in heaven, we love you. We pray for you. We cheerlead your soul to heaven. And if you get attacked by evil, we got your back. Okay? Alright? Okay? So, the corruption known as prejudice is what makes you give up. That's why it's there. It's there to make you give up so you don't deliver your soul to heaven. Okay? What evil does is evil breaks love, keeps it weak in fear. Okay? By keeping your love weak in fear, you'll be defending Satan. Okay? What did I say? Live in fear, defend Satan. Remove your fear, defend heaven. Okay? Did you know when you remove all your fear, your soul enters heaven? Did you know that? Well, now you do. Okay? All right. Um, fear goes against two things. Okay? Fear goes against you believing in yourself and believing in heaven. Okay? All right? That's what fear does. Fear goes against you believing in yourself and believing in heaven. So when you deliver your soul to heaven correctly, this is what you're doing, okay? You're, you're, you're always going to believe in yourself, okay? When you deliver your soul to heaven, you're always going to believe in yourself. Yes, you can deliver your soul to heaven, okay? All right? And never, ever give up to win against evil, okay? What that does is that removes your fear, okay? And it keeps the fear out. So, okay? So what I'm showing you how to do is become powerful, unbreakable. Just like Jesus Christ. Okay? That's what I'm showing you in my videos. Okay? Alright? So, so, excuse me. The corruption of prejudice is there to keep your love weak in fear. That's why it's there. The corruption of prejudice is there to keep your love weak in fear. Evil is there to keep your love weak in fear.
okay? The prejudice is in the evil, okay? This causes you to give up. So you never deliver your soul to heaven, and you never see the truth from heaven, okay? When you remove all your fear, you start to see the truth from heaven. I learned the truth from heaven. Everything I explain to you comes from heaven. Nothing comes from down on this planet, okay? Everything I explain to you comes from heaven, okay? When you deliver your soul to heaven correctly, this is what you're doing. You're defending your love. You're defending heaven while delivering your soul to heaven. You'll be defending love and freedom with its forces of love, okay? That's what you'll be doing, okay? You'll be defending love and freedom with its forces of love. When you're defending love and freedom with its forces of love, you'll be defending heaven, okay? Because that's what heaven is. Heaven is a beautiful, tranquil, pure love and freedom for your soul. That's what heaven is, okay? And you'll be defending that, okay? Right? As long as you stay unbreakable, you win, okay? As long as you stay unbreakable, you win. As long as evil can't break you, you win, okay? You don't have to say nothing at all. As long as you stay unbreakable, you win. And when you win, heaven wins, okay? All right? So, okay? So, uh, what else could I throw in there? Prejudice makes you give up. That's why it's there. The corruption known as prejudice makes you give up. That's why I tell you never ever give up to win against evil. Okay? Alright? The corruption is known as prejudice and hate. Okay? When we remove the fear, we will remove the prejudice and hate. Okay? Out of your love. There's prejudice and hate in love. Okay? And when we remove the fear, we remove the prejudice and hate, which is the corruption that is in love. Okay? When we remove the fear, we remove the prejudice and hate out of your love. And what that does is when you remove all your prejudice and your hate out of your love, you will stop prejudging and hating others. Okay? When you remove all your prejudice and hate out of your love, you will stop prejudging and hating others, okay, all right, um, I just wanted to throw that in there, uh, yeah, okay, so, so it's very important, the corruption that is found in love is known as prejudice, okay, now, I learned this word because I've heard it, and I learned it from heaven, Okay? I was asked by heaven to fight prejudice. Okay? I was asked by heaven to fight prejudice. Okay? Alright? So. So that's how I got that word, okay? I was asked by heaven to fight prejudice. Fight prejudice. That's what heaven told me, okay? All right? It was a, yeah, fight prejudice. It was a woman's voice, actually, told me to fight prejudice. Okay? Heaven asked me to fight prejudice. Okay? And that's why I'm fighting evil today. Okay? And I had to learn the truth about prejudice. So I learned that prejudice makes you give up, okay? As my love got stronger and stronger and stronger, I learned that prejudice makes you give up, okay? So that's why I tell you never ever give up to win against evil, okay? You always believe in yourself. Yes, you can deliver your soul to heaven and never ever give up to win against evil, okay? This will make your love powerful and unbreakable, just like Jesus Christ, okay? And believe in heaven again. Heaven is a pure love and freedom for your soul, okay? When you think of Jesus Christ, think of a pure love and freedom for your soul, okay? All right? What I'm showing you how to do is remove your fear, 
Okay? The more fear you remove out of your love, the more your love will increase. Okay? What's blocking you from seeing the truth from heaven is fear. What's blocking you from delivering your soul to heaven is fear. Okay? Fear is what Satan uses to control us. That's what Satan uses, is fear. Okay? People that live in fear are programmed by Satan to attack heaven with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Okay? Let me repeat that again. People that live in fear are programmed by Satan to attack heaven with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Okay? Alright? All this is the truth from heaven. Okay? Alright? Uh, yeah. Alright, so... Now we're going to talk about the war for heaven, okay? A long, long, long time ago, a war started against heaven. Okay? Alright? They say this is when Satan got kicked out of heaven, okay? Back before the war started before heaven, you were delivering your souls to heaven. Okay? Back before the war started against heaven. This is back before civilization. You were delivering your souls to heaven. Okay? Because you had to live in the wild to survive. Okay? You had to survive in the wild. So what did you do? You believed in yourselves. Yes, you can. Okay? And you never give up to win. To survive in the wild. Okay? And that kept your souls in heaven while you were alive. That made you unconditional love. Okay? Back when we were caveman, cavewoman, Indians, things like that. We had this instinct in us that delivered our souls to heaven. Okay? Alright? And that instinct was believing in yourself. Yes, you can. Okay? And never giving up to win. To survive in the wild. Okay? That was the instinct. And that kept your soul in heaven while you were alive. That made you unconditional love. Yeah. Okay? Animals deliver their souls to heaven the same way. Okay? They believe in themselves. Yes, they can. Okay? They believe in themselves. Yes, they can. And they never give up to win. To survive in the wild. That's how animals are unconditional love. Their souls are already in heaven while they're alive. Okay? So this way when they die, their soul stays in heaven. Okay? So when you die, your soul stays in heaven. If your soul's already in heaven and you never give up the win, your soul stays in heaven after you die. Okay? Alright? So what happened was we had this instinct in us, right? That delivered our souls to heaven. And then this war started against heaven. Okay? And when the war started against heaven, they say that this is where Satan got kicked out of heaven. This is long before Jesus Christ. This is back before civilization, okay? Back when we were cavemen, cavewomen, Indians, things like that. All right? So what happened was the war started against heaven. Everybody went into fear. Because Satan is fear. Fear is Satan. Fear is not allowed in heaven, okay? Fear is not allowed in heaven. Right? That's why you must remove your fear. Okay? Alright? So what happens is you all wanted to fear. Okay? This is back before civilization. They say Satan got kicked out of heaven. This is when you all went into fear because Satan is fear. You all went into fear and you stopped delivering your souls to heaven. That's what happened. Okay? And when fear was created, so was prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. This is when evil was created. Okay? This is when the war started against heaven. Okay? And as civilization spread throughout the land, so did fear and evil, keeping your souls out of heaven. Okay? All right? What evil does is evil breaks love and keeps it weak. That's why evil is there. The reason evil is there is to break love, keep it weak in fear, so you never deliver your souls 
to heaven and you never fight back evil. If you don't deliver your soul to heaven, you're never going to fight back evil. Okay? When you deliver your soul to heaven correctly, your love fights back evil. When you deliver your soul to heaven correctly. Okay? All right? Uh, that's how the war started against heaven. Yeah. Because back before the war started, back before this war started, you were delivering your souls to heaven. You had this instinct in you that delivered your souls to heaven. Back when you were caveman, cavewoman, Indians, things like that. Okay? All right? Then the war started against heaven. That's where fear was created because Satan is fear. Fear is Satan. Okay? And this is where you stop delivering your souls to heaven. Okay? Things like socialism, communism, and dictatorships. These are evil. Okay? Let me repeat that again. Things like socialism, communism, and dictatorships. These are evil. These keep your souls out of heaven because they have prejudice and hate in them. Okay? All right? Uh, they especially got hate and corruption in them. Okay? Things like socialism, communism, and dictatorships. Okay? All right? Uh, yeah. Okay? So, and that's how the war started against heaven. And back when this war started against heaven, so was prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Was created from the fear. Because prejudgment, prejudice, and hate is created from fear. Okay? And that's why everybody started prejudging and hating each other. Okay? Alright? And that's where evil was created. Okay? When the war started against heaven. Okay? Alright? Uh... What else? We get attacked by evil two different ways, okay? If you're a country or a group of people, okay? If you're a country and a, or a group of people and you get attacked by evil, you get attacked by terrorism, okay? Terrorism is evil, okay? You get attacked by terrorism if you're a group of people or a country, okay? What this does, what this attacks, this attacks love and freedom and creates fear on the people, okay? That's terrorism, okay? If you're one individual and you get attacked by evil, you get attacked by prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, okay? All right? This, what this does is, this breaks love. It keeps it weak. That's what that does, okay? The prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. It breaks love, keeps it weak in fear, so you never fight back evil, and you never deliver your soul to heaven. Okay? And you'll never see the truth from heaven. Okay? Alright? If you want to learn the truth about prejudice and hate, you have to deliver your soul to heaven. If you want to learn the truth about prejudice and hate. Okay? You have to deliver your soul to heaven for that. You learn that from heaven. You learn how to fight prejudice and hate from heaven. Okay? I know the truth about prejudgment, prejudice and hate because I delivered my soul to heaven accidentally. Okay? And when I delivered my soul to heaven accidentally, I could see the prejudice and the hate. Okay? Then later on, as I increased the forces of my love, I could see how I was attacked by prejudice and hate, okay? When you get attacked by prejudice and hate, this is what you get attacked by. You get attacked by hate, ball breaking, chop breaking, the stabbing in the back, prejudice attack, they talk behind your back, they blame you for this, blame you for that, everything is your fault, Nothing you do is ever good enough, etc., etc., etc. Forget about it. Okay? That's what you get attacked by. Okay? I know because I was attacked by all of that. All right? Because I was accidentally delivering my soul to heaven. I was constantly attacked by prejudgment, 
prejudice and hate throughout my life because I was in the war for heaven. Because I'm in the war for heaven. Okay? All right? So, I learned the difference between the forces of love and evil from heaven. Okay? All right? Uh, yeah. Okay? So when one individual gets attacked by evil, they get attacked by prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Repeat after me. Prejudgment, prejudice, and hate is evil. Okay? All right? And what this does is we got our prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards. Okay? All right? They live in fear. All right? These are enemy combatants to heaven. Okay? Because you're in the war for heaven. So they are enemy combatants to heaven. Okay? And what they do is they are programmed by Satan to break love and keep it weak in fear. They are programmed by Satan to break love and keep it weak in fear. Okay? That's why I get attacked by a lot of prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, because I delivered my soul to heaven. Okay? All right? So, okay? Uh, what else um, can we talk about? Things that are created from fear, uh, prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, evil, is created from fear. Prejudice is created from fear. Okay? When we remove the fear, we remove the prejudice out of the love. Okay? The prejudice is the corruption that is found in love. That gets removed by removing the fear. Okay? All right? Uh, prejudgment, prejudice, and hate is created from fear. Okay? Fear is created from prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Okay? Fear is created from evil. So it's a vicious cycle of fear and evil that is keeping your soul out of heaven. What it does is evil breaks love, keeps it weak. Evil will break your love, keep it weak in fear. So you never see the truth from heaven and you never deliver your soul to heaven. Okay? That's what evil does. Okay? So evil breaks love, keeps it weak in fear. So it's actually a vicious cycle of fear and evil. Evil creates fear. Fear creates evil. This is a vicious cycle keeping your soul out of heaven. Okay? That's what that does. Alright? Uh, what else is created from fear? Um, prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. We got terrorism is created from the prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, which is created from the fear. Okay? Alright, uh, what else? We have mental illness and suicide. Mental illness and suicide is caused from prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Okay? Mental illness and suicide. Okay? What happens with mental illness is that is the causes and effect. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, that is the causes and effect between the forces of love and evil. That causes mental illness, okay? And that also causes suicide, okay? What happens is the person enters the war for heaven. They start having mental problems, okay? And what's going to happen is they're going to have problems, you know? Things like panic attacks, anxiety, uh, depression. I suffer from depression. My depression was caused by evil, by the way, just so you know. The depression I was in was caused by evil. My mental illness was caused by evil. Okay? So what happens is this causes mental illness on them. They start going into anxiety, paranoia, panic attacks, uh, what else? Uh, all kinds of ailments. Okay? And what happens is this hurts them, when, especially when they go into a deep depression. Because depression hurts, okay? And what happens is this breaks them into depression. And this hurts. This hurts them. Okay? And what that does is evil break, breaks their love. Causing them to give up. 
That's what prejudice makes them give up. Okay? And when they give up, they commit suicide. Okay? If you commit suicide, Satan wins. Okay? If you don't commit suicide, you win. Okay? So, don't ever think about committing suicide. If you commit suicide, Satan wins. Okay? Because you're in the war for heaven. All right? Okay? So. All right? Uh, what else? Um, we got hate and corruption. Okay? Where there's hate and corruption, there's pain and suffering. Okay? Hate and corruption is prejudice and hate. Okay? In order to fight back the hate and corruption, we need to remove the fear. Okay? Removing the fear will increase the forces of love. When we increase the forces of love, we start fighting back evil. We start to fight back prejudice and hate. Okay? When we remove the fear. Okay? Uh, yeah. All right? If everybody was to remove their fear, we can wipe the evil off this planet. Okay? If everybody was to remove their fear. Okay? And deliver their soul to heaven correctly. Okay? All right? Yeah. Yeah, all right? That's how we fight back prejudice and hate. Okay? And we fight back uh, hate and corruption. Okay? Uh, what else? Um, chaos, that's created from prejudice and hate. Okay? Which is created from fear. All the bad stuff you see going on around the world, it's created from fear. It's all created from fear because Satan is fear. Fear is Satan. Okay? All right? That's why we must remove the fear. Okay? All right? I was attacked by a lot of evil. I was attacked by a lot of prejudgment, prejudice, and hate down through the years. I know the truth. Okay? I know the truth. This is the truth from heaven. Okay? In order to fight prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, you have to learn the truth from heaven. Okay? All right? So, uh, what else? Um, yeah. As you deliver your soul to heaven, what happens is your love increases. Okay? Because you're delivering your soul to the truth. Okay? All right? So, what happens is as you remove more and more of your fear, your love will increase. The forces of your love will increase. Okay? All right? Uh, never give up to win against evil. Okay? Jesus Christ never ever gives up to win against evil. Okay? All right? So, always believe in yourself and never give up to win against evil. Okay? All right? Uh, animals win when they die. Okay? Uh, now we're going to talk about removing your fear <clears throat> and delivering your souls to heaven, okay? We're going to remove your fear and deliver your souls to heaven. That's what we're going to talk about, okay? Um, animals win when they die, okay? Now how do, how do they do this? Animals believe in themselves, right? And they never give up to win, Okay? To survive in the wild okay that makes them unconditional love so this way when they die because they never give up the win when they die their soul stays in heaven because they never give up to win okay well you're doing the same thing okay so it works the same way with a human okay Jesus Christ never ever gives up to win against evil that's how Jesus Christ conquered evil. Okay? Alright? And I want you to do the same. Okay? What I'm showing you how to do is follow Jesus Christ to heaven against evil. This is how I follow Jesus Christ to heaven against evil. 
is what I'm explaining to you. How I follow Jesus Christ to heaven against evil. Okay? That's what I'm explaining to you in my videos. Okay? All right? Uh, what else? Um, don't fear God. They got you fearing God. Don't fear God. At Jesus Christ's love in heaven, we love you. We pray for you. We cheerlead your soul to heaven. And if you get attacked by evil, we got your back. Okay? All right? Make Jesus Christ your best friend. Okay? I make Jesus Christ my best friend. I can talk to Jesus Christ anytime I want. All right? I don't fear God. Okay? Don't fear God. That's the worst thing you can do. Okay? Because if you fear God, you're going to fear the forces of love. Okay? All right? I want you to make Jesus Christ your best friend. Okay? Make God your best friend. Okay? Do you fear your best friend? No. So you got it. It's your relationship with God. Your relationship with God is don't fear Him. Okay? Don't fear God. Uh, make God your best friend. Don't fear the Lord. Don't fear God. Don't fear Jesus Christ. Okay? At Jesus Christ's love in heaven, we love you. We pray for you. We cheerlead your soul to heaven. And if you get attacked by evil, we got your back. Okay? Don't fear the forces of love. Okay? All right? Okay? Uh, you're not going to fear judgment. You don't have to fear judgment. You want to know why you're not going to fear judgment? Because you're delivering your soul to heaven before you die. Okay? That's why. Okay? There is no judgment in the forces of love. Okay? You're the judge whether you want to deliver your soul to heaven or not. Okay? You're the judge. Okay? All right? And you're not going to fear death. You want to know why you're not going to fear death? Because if your soul enters heaven and you never give up to win, that means you're going to win when you die. If you know you're going to win when you die, you're not going to fear death. I don't fear death. Okay? I don't fear Jesus. I don't fear judgment. And I don't fear death. I don't fear at all. I have no fear of you because I believed in myself. And I never give up to win against evil. Okay? All right? That's why I have no fear in me. I removed all my fear. And my soul entered heaven. Okay? All right? Uh, what else? Um, yeah. Okay? Do what they say can't be done. Now, what I mean by do what they say can't be done, I mean by things like I can't. I cannot, you can't, you cannot, that's impossible. Those are the laws of prejudice. They're there to make you give up. Okay? We don't ever, ever want you to give up to win against evil. Okay? All right? So, all right? Uh, make that motivation when you hear that. When you hear things like, I can't, I cannot, you can't, you cannot, uh... Things like that. Those are the laws of prejudice. Those are discouragements. Discouragements are the laws of prejudice. Okay? I want you to bust evil. I don't want evil breaking you. I want you to break evil. Okay? All right? So that's very important. We want you to bust the laws of prejudice so you break evil. Okay? All right? The laws of prejudice are there to make you give up. Okay? That's your own fear. Your own fear is what makes you give up. Okay? Alright? That's Satan. Your own fear is what makes you give up. That's what causes you to say, I can't do this and I can't do that. That comes from your own fear. Okay? Alright? When you hear things like, you can't, you cannot do this, and you can't, and that's impossible, that's prejudice. Okay? That's the laws of prejudice coming from somebody else. Okay? Don't give up. Okay? Never ever give up to win against evil. Okay? Alright? Jesus Christ never ever gives up to win against evil. We want you to always believe in yourself. 
Yes, you can deliver your soul to heaven and never give up to win against evil. Okay? And what that's going to do is that's going to start removing your fear. Okay? We're going to start removing the fear and we're going to start keeping the fear out. That's what we're doing. We're removing the fear and we're keeping the fear out. Okay? So, when you believe in yourself and you never give up to win against evil, we're removing the fear and we're keeping the fear out. Okay? All right? So, all right? Because I'm showing you how to follow Jesus Christ to heaven against evil. Okay? All right? Uh, what else? Uh, I only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. I only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. Okay? I only bow and break to the forces of love. I call that the forces of love. Jesus Christ's love in heaven. Okay? I only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. That is the forces of love. Okay? I only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. I do not bow and break to anything else. Okay? I do not bow and break to prejudice and hate. I do not bow and break to prejudice and hate. Okay? Excuse me. All right? So, all right? Uh, what else? As you're removing more and more of your fear, you're going to overcome things, okay? I overcame drinking a long time ago. Okay? All right? I was being attacked by prejudgment, prejudice, and hate because I lived in a quagmire of hate. Okay? And I accidentally delivered my soul to heaven. Okay? So what happened was I was attacked by evil for delivering my soul to heaven. Okay? Now you may get attacked by evil, you may not. I want you to overcome suicide. That's the toughest one. I want you to overcome suicide. Okay? All right? So, all right, I want you to overcome suicide. All right? You're probably going to overcome some of your bad habits, but the biggest one I want you to overcome is suicide because what happens is evil creates suicide. Okay? And if we never give up to win against evil, that's going to prevent suicide. Okay? That's why we never ever give up to win against evil. To prevent suicide. Okay? Alright? Um, if you commit suicide, Satan wins. If you don't commit suicide, you win. Okay? Alright? I was attacked by evil for delivering my soul to heaven. Okay? Right? Uh, this hurt. I was hurt for a long time. And what happened was my entire life and career was destroyed. Destroyed. My entire life and career was destroyed for delivering my soul to heaven. Okay? So what I had to do is I had to find something else to do. I was fired and blacklisted from my job, never to work again. Okay? I can't get a job because I'm prejudged and hated. Okay? My love reacts against fear. And then I am prejudged and hated. And I'm going to make sure the world finds out about this. Okay? So that's what I'm doing. Alright? I am prejudged and hated. The forces of my love reacts against fear. Right? Then I'm prejudged and hated by everyone that lives in fear. Okay? Alright? So, what happened was that caused me to get attacked by evil. Okay? So, I couldn't go back to work. So, I didn't know what I was going to do with my life. Okay? I went to mental illness. I kind of had a mental breakdown, I guess. And this hurt. I was hurt for a long time. And in order to come out of that, I had to find something else to do. Okay? And what I did was I started singing. I started doing karaoke. 
and it started making me feel better, my soul was injured from that, from being attacked by evil. My soul was injured. And when I started singing and doing the karaoke, and I started taking it on as a talent, that's when I started repairing my soul and stuff like that. Okay? All right? So you can overcome evil and things like that, okay? All right? Uh, I was attacked by evil for delivering my soul to heaven because I live in a quagmire of hate, okay? All right? Uh, what else? Yeah, okay? What happens is, as you remove more and more and more of your fear, this is what you're doing. You're defending your love, you're defending heaven while delivering your soul to heaven. You're defending love and freedom with its forces of love, okay? You'll be defending heaven because you made your love powerful and unbreakable, just like Jesus Christ, okay? All right? So what happens is as you remove more and more of your fear, you're going to stop prejudging and hating others because you're removing the corruption out of your love. This removes the corruption out of your love. Remember that corruption we were talking about earlier? This removes that corruption. When you remove your fear, you remove the corruption out of your love. You will stop prejudging and hating others. Okay? All right? Uh, you start to overcome some of your bad habits. Okay? What I overcame was, I overcame suicide. Then I overcame smoking. Okay? I quit smoking. It wasn't easy, but I quit smoking. I used a patch, okay? I still had to use something to help me do it. I didn't just quit. Uh, what else? Then as time went on, and my love increased, and I learned that love was powerful and unbreakable, things like that, and I started learning the truth from heaven, I overcame mental illness, okay? Because I was mentally ill, all right? So I overcame mental illness, okay? All right? So, eventually I overcame mental illness, all right? I still take my medications, but I just don't have any anxiety or panic attacks or anything like that anymore, okay? I overcame all that, so. Because my mental illness was caused by evil, okay? All right? So, okay? So, and what happens is as you remove more more of your fear, this is going to increase the forces of your love, okay? You're going to become a non-sinner. Eventually, you become a non-sinner because you removed all the corruption out of your love. Like I said, you will stop prejudging and hating others. You remove the corruption out of your love. You become a non-sinner. Then your soul enters heaven. You know what that means? That means you win, okay? Never ever give up to win against evil. But now on, for the rest of your life, never ever give up to win against evil. Okay? And your soul stays in heaven, even after you die. That means you're gonna win when you die. Okay? You win! Alright? Okay? So... Okay? It's a great feeling. Knowing that you're gonna win when you die, that is the greatest feeling in the world. You're not gonna worry so much about your life if you do this. If you do this, you're not gonna worry about your life so much. Okay? I don't worry about my life. Because I know I'm in no good for heaven. So, all right, so, and I know life ain't going to be great for me because I'm a new one for heaven, okay? So what I do is I go out and I sing, uh, things like that. I try to go out and sing. Singing is one of my talents, uh, and that's keeping me out of my depression, singing, okay? So, I sing. Uh, I go to a worship center. That's where I bow and break to Jesus Christ, love in heaven. At the worship center. Okay? I go there on Sundays. Alright? And... Yeah. So... Okay? I'm in the war for heaven. Okay? Alright? So... Alright. When, you when your soul enters heaven, 
you're going to become unconditional love. Okay? You're going to become unconditional love. You're going to sense things like fear, hate, and love. You're going to sense this stuff. Okay? All right? Uh, always believe in yourself. Never ever give up to win against the evil. Okay? All right? Yes, you can deliver your soul to heaven. Okay? Your soul gets delivered to heaven before you die. Okay? While you're alive. Okay? All right? And this is what I'm explaining in my videos, okay? So you can deliver your soul to heaven before you die. Okay? All right? This is going to make you a warrior for heaven. Okay? Alright? Now we're going to talk about the causes and effect between evil and its forces of love. Okay? Alright? Let me explain what evil is first. Okay? We have our evil. We have evil. We have prejudgment, prejudice and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards that live in fear. What did I say? Live in fear, defend Satan, okay? The prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards, they live in fear. These are enemy combatants to heaven, okay? These are enemy combatants to heaven, okay? They are an enemy to heaven, okay? All right? All right. Uh, what they attack is, they attack the truth from heaven, which would be what I'm explaining to you. They attack the truth from heaven, they hate heaven, right? And they attack the forces of love that come from heaven, which would be me, okay? And I get attacked all the time, I know, okay? Uh, that's what they attack, okay? That is Satan's army, okay? All right? They are programmed by Satan to attack heaven with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. They are programmed by Satan to attack heaven with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. Okay? All right? All right, now, you're delivering your soul to heaven. This is what you're doing. If you're delivering your soul to heaven correctly, this is what you're doing. You're defending your love, heaven, while delivering your soul to heaven. Okay? You'll be defending love and freedom with its forces of love. Okay? What did I say? Evil attacks love and freedom and creates fear. Evil attacks love and freedom and creates fear. You'll be defending love and freedom with its forces of love. Okay? Well, what happens is when you're defending love and freedom with its forces of love, you're defending heaven. When you make your love unbreakable, you're defending heaven heaven okay when you win heaven wins okay all right when you make your love unbreakable you're defending heaven okay I don't allow anything to break me I am unbreakable love okay this is why I'm defending heaven okay I am a warrior I am defending heaven I am unbreakable love. Okay? That's what I'm going to that's what I'm showing you how to do in my videos is become unbreakable love. You don't want your love to be broken, okay? So what happens is the prejudgment, prejudice and hate, demons, trolls and cowards, they break love. They're programmed by Satan to break love. Okay? They're going to try to break you. Okay? That's what they're going to do when your love reacts against their fear. When your love reacts against their fear, that's going to drive them mad. Okay? That drives them mad. And then they attack you with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. This is what they're going to attack you with. Hate. Ball breaking. Chop breaking. The stab in the back. Prejudice attack. They're going to talk behind your back. They're going to blame you for this. Blame you for that. 
everything is your fault, nothing you do is ever good enough, etc., etc., etc. Forget about it, okay? Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil, okay? That's going to make your love unbreakable. So they can't break your love, okay? You don't have to say nothing at all. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil, okay? You want to know the truth, what happened to Jesus Christ? I'm going to tell you the truth, what happened to Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is powerful, unbreakable love, okay? All right? And when he was alive, his love reacted against fear. And when his love reacted against their fear, that drove them mad. That drove the prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards. It drove them mad. And then they attacked him causing his crucifixion, okay? All right? They could not break Jesus, even when he was on the cross. They did nothing but try to break him. They could not break Jesus, even when he was on the cross, okay? Jesus is unbreakable. They could not break Jesus, even when he was on the cross. His soul was already in heaven before he was put on the cross. His soul stayed in heaven after he died because he never gives up to win against evil. Because he never gives up to win against evil, he wins. He won. Okay? And his soul stayed in heaven. Okay? That's what happened. His love reacted against fear. When his love reacted against fear, he drove the prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards, he drove them mad. And then they attacked him. And that's when they crucified him. Okay? He could not be broken even when he was on the cross. Okay? They couldn't break his love. His love was unbreakable even when he was on the cross. That I learned from heaven. I learned the truth about Jesus Christ from heaven. Okay? I learned that Jesus Christ was powerful, unbreakable love. His love cannot be broken. Right? And what else? My love cannot be broken. Okay? My love cannot be broken. Okay? That's how come I'm able to explain all this to you. And deliver my soul to heaven. Okay? Because I am unbreakable love. Okay? Alright? So, because I'm a warrior for heaven. I'm unbreakable love. That's how come I got the truth about Jesus Christ from heaven. Okay? Jesus Christ was attacked by evil before he could show you how to deliver your souls to heaven. That I learned from heaven. The first week my soul entered heaven. That's what I learned. That's why I'm making these videos showing you how to fight evil. I'm showing you how to conquer evil, win, and deliver your soul to heaven. That's what I'm showing you in my videos. Okay? All right? Okay. Let's say somebody uh let's say somebody hates you. They're breaking your balls, breaking your chops. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. They're trying to break you. Okay? They're trying to break you. They are programmed by Satan to break love. Okay? Alright? Alright? I don't forgive them because I don't allow them to break me. Okay? I'm in a war. I'm not in a religion. I am in a war. This is why I don't forgive them. Okay? Because I am in a war. Okay? So. Alright? If you were in a war and you forgave the enemy, you would never win the war. You would never win the war. Okay? That's why I don't forgive them. If I want forgiveness, I ask Jesus Christ for forgiveness and I get forgiveness, okay? If the person apologized to me and asked for forgiveness, I forgive them, no problem, okay? But they don't ask me for forgiveness. That rarely happens. That only happened one time where a person apologized to me for an incident. It was months later and then he apologized to me and then I forgave him. You know, so, but 
Yeah, I was treated like a secondhand citizen because of this. Okay? I was treated very badly. All right? Let's say somebody hates you, they're breaking your balls, breaking your chops. Okay? Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. You don't have to say nothing at all. Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. Okay? When you get attacked by prejudice and hate, when you get attacked by its prejudice and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards, this is what you're going to get attacked by. Hate, ball breaking, chop breaking, the stabbing in the back, prejudice attack, they're going to talk behind your back, they're going to blame you for this, blame you for that, everything is your fault, nothing you do is ever good enough, etc., etc., etc. Forget about it. Okay? All right? Okay? What happens is the forces of your love is going to drive them mad. The forces of your love drives them mad. Then they're not going to leave you alone. Then they're not going to leave you alone because the forces of your love is driving them mad. That's where the hate comes from. Hate's created from fear. Okay? Prejudice and hate is created from fear. These people live in fear. The prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards, they live in fear. That's why they defend Satan. They are enemy combatants to heaven because you're in the war for heaven. You're a warrior for heaven. You have entered the war for heaven. When you deliver your soul to heaven correctly, you will enter the war for heaven. Okay? All right? Let's say somebody's breaking your balls, breaking your chops. And they won't leave you alone because you're driving them mad. Okay? Don't give up, don't give in, always win against evil. You don't have to say nothing at all. But you can tell them to go pound sand, go kick rocks. Or you can tell them, hey, go take your prejudice and hate. And you can shove it up your, you can tell them where to stick it. That's how we slay demons around here. Okay? I don't allow them to break me. Okay? I am powerful, unbreakable love. I don't allow them to break me. Nobody likes me, but I don't allow them to break me. Okay? I'm defending heaven. When they live in fear, they're defending Satan. When they live in fear, they're defending Satan. When you live in fear, you defend Satan. You attack the truth from heaven. You hate heaven. Then you attack the forces of love that come from heaven. If you live in fear. You are programmed by Satan to attack heaven with prejudgment, prejudice, and hate. If you live in fear. If you remove your fear, you'll be defending heaven. You'll be defending your love, heaven, while delivering your soul to heaven. You'll be, de you'll be defending love and freedom with its forces of love. You will be defending heaven. When you make your love unbreakable, when you make your love powerful and unbreakable, just like Jesus Christ, you're defending heaven. That means you conquered evil. Okay? When your soul enters heaven, you conquered evil. I want you to throw that in there. Yeah. But you conquered evil when you deliver your soul to heaven correctly. When you deliver your soul to heaven correctly, you conquer evil. This makes you a warrior for heaven. Because now you're in no war for heaven. Okay? All right? Uh, what else? I think that's enough. Um, yeah. We at Jesus Christ Love in Heaven, we love you, we pray for you, we cheerlead your soul to heaven, and if you get attacked by evil, we got your back. Okay? I only bow and break to Jesus Christ Love in Heaven. I only bow and break to the forces of love. Okay? 
I only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. I do not bow and break to anything else. Okay? That's pretty important right there. Okay? You want to be a good warrior? Only bow and break to Jesus Christ's love in heaven. Okay? And you'll be a good warrior. When you win, heaven wins. When you win, heaven wins. Okay? As long as your love stays unbreakable, you win. If evil can't break your love, you win. Okay? Anytime evil can't break your love, you win. Anytime these prejudgment, prejudice, and hate, demons, trolls, and cowards can't break you, you win. Okay? When you win, heaven wins. Okay? Evil is there to break love and keep it weak in fear. That's the reason why it's there. The reason evil is there is to keep your soul out of heaven. That is the reason why it's there. Okay? All right? So, I gotta throw that in there for you. All right? Uh, yeah. At Jesus Christ, love in heaven, we love you, we pray for you, we cheerlead your soul to heaven. And if you get attacked by evil, we got your back, okay? A good warrior never ever gives up to win against evil. They kick the crap out of evil and they deliver their soul to heaven, okay? All right? So, just figured I'd throw that in here for you, all right? Okay? Until next week, I love you. Bye.